Hi everybody, I am a comedian. My stage name is Drew by the Sea, and tonight I'm performing comedy for you. We're gonna do some jokes about Valentine's Day. Little hearts. <laughs> uh, love is an interesting topic. If you guys don't mind, I like to talk about love. Is anybody here looking for love? Out on the dating apps, yeah, maybe? <laughs> I've also opened myself up to new possibilities. So I go on Didi. I go on Didi. That's where I go because I'm now in a married relationship and intimacy and love and sweet talk, that goes out the door. But my new flame driver, Jong, just sent me a text tonight. He said, sir, it is very rainy. Please stand somewhere safe. I said, uh, that's kind of sweet of him. And I started to sort of dream, you know, what if, what if he works really hard and he saves up money, we can finally afford a house in Shanghai together, and he could wear his nice black suit every night, and I can welcome him home, and I can say, Driver Zhang, you are my five-star man. <laughs> Did you guys all go away for a spring festival and then come back? Yeah. You have to, right? Your partner, if they're female like mine, she likes to become an amateur shipping agent during spring festival. So this involves her putting a bunch of packages, boxes, oranges, presents, extra blankets and things into her, you know, whatever device she's contracted, to put together a rope, a plastic bag, some leftover napkin. She ties it all up with tape and then she puts it on my back. And I have to go through the train station and they look at me and they sort of, why is this happening? The answer is that's what love is. You carry all of your wife's luggage. Right? I like to say that I've acquired a lot of life skills. I am my wife's professional photographer, <laughs> bodyguard, luggage handler. Occasionally, I am her psychiatrist. I don't really do anything when I'm her psychiatrist. I just sit there and go, mm-hmm, 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 mm -hmm. She actually really likes that. Um, summing it up, though, this sort of irony of love, we do couple goal lists. You guys ever do those? They're as annoying as they sound. Uh, but, but they're also, they can be romantic. We put we were going to get married. We put we were going to be happy. We did all those things. But she said she wanted to put some things on her goal list that would make her more independent. And I said, I can't wait to find out what independent thing you want to do that I have to pay for. <laughs> can't wait. So it was driving lessons so that she could get her Chinese driving license. And she worked really hard. She got her license. And she came running up to me one day. She said, husband, husband, la gong, la gong. I got it, I got it, look. When she had her little Chinese driver's license, she was so excited. I said, that is amazing, honey. What do you want to do? She said, I want to rent a car. So we went to Chongming Island. Have you guys been there? It's a beautiful island where you go and you leave a big pile of your money. And we rented a car. We rented a car. And I said, honey, are you so happy that you can drive the car? And she said, husband, I'm so happy. You know why, la? I said, why? She said, now you can drive me around. <laughs> So uh, she decided we would practice one morning, and this is kind of just a cute story. So uh, we got up early, and the roads were completely empty. And I thought, this is a good time to practice. Nothing can go wrong. And it was actually a beautiful day, blue sky, sun is shining, everything's gorgeous. Nobody's on these roads. And she's got the road to herself, and she comes to an intersection, stops, light turns green, and she does nothing. And I'm like, oh, those lessons were not worth what I paid for. <laughs> but she says, husband, husband, look, 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 a bird. And in the middle of the road, there's one little bird. All the lessons went over all the driving techniques, but apparently zero flying methods, nothing at all. So she said, what do I do? And I said, honey, uh, they might not have gone over this in class, but the bird knows how to be a bird. Please just be a car, okay? Drive up the road. You guys have been fantastic. Thank you for letting me make you laugh tonight. I'm Drew by the Sea. Please welcome your host back to the stage. Woo! Drew by the Sea, everybody.